Okay, so the last one we do, Victoria, is a omelette. omelette. Perfect. Uh, so we just cracked the egg into the, the bowl. What have you done? Yeah. A bit of milk in there just again? Just put a bit of milk in and just whisk it up. Uh, again, if you want to do a Spanish style omelette, you can add tomatoes, you can add onions, you can add mushrooms, whatever you want to. Yeah. So we preheated the cookware. I just yep. put uh, two, three sprays of the uh, one cow spray in there. That's right. That's it. Put the mixture in. And then you'll see because it's just a one egg omelette it's going to be quite a thin one okay okay well, obviously if you wanted to have two it's it's up to you it's your preference you can have two or three egg omelette but what's nice about this is it's going to cook quite quickly because it's thinner so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to move the mixture around so it cooks all the way through like that there we go it's just going to be easier to flip it okay so i'll just flip that around a bit there we are And what I do is I put the lid on just for maybe a minute or so, just to give it time for it to solidify and then we can flip it over. Okay, there we go. That's it, just for a couple of minutes. So you can either flip this over if you want to, or you can just, as you would at home, just normally. Like that. That looks great, sorry. Put the lid on. Just about 30 seconds, not even that really, because you know where they get cooked. So at this point, this is the point where you could put your spinach inside or maybe your cheese, maybe fill it with tomatoes. Then you can fold it, and that's what we call a Spanish omelette. Perfect. Okay. How oh, easy. Easy, isn't it? Yeah, it's really okay, good. So that's great. So you can, then you all can we fold do. it in half. So you can either fold it in half with the mixture in there, but all I'm going to do now is I'm just going to put that out onto the plate and just flip that over. And there's your omelette.